The main hospital in Kotobi lies deserted, a crumbling wreck in the aftermath of years of ongoing conflict in the area, about 200 kilometers from South Sudan's capital, Juba. The lack of access to health care is intensifying the suffering of displaced people who have little or no food, access to clean water or adequate shelter after fleeing to Kotobi to escape the violence. The facilities in Kotobi reflect the dilapidated state of other hospitals in the area. Similarly, in other remote locations of Mundri, residents say that they are also suffering from the lack of medical care. Over the past five years, armed conflict and bad road conditions have interfered with efforts to rehabilitate or replace destroyed hospitals and other medical facilities. A team from the United Nations Mission in South Sudan visiting the area to hear from communities witnessed firsthand the difficulties both residents and the displaced communities have to live with. The health facilities are so there. We have learned that in the recent past, some pregnant women died because they could not have access to medical services. We have learned also that some children died because of hunger. And with this kind of situation, it is appalling to us and we are very much concerned. A local chief says help comes in drips and drabs. He wants a facility that is capable of treating people in urgent medical situations. Health, of course, there is a problem with health. Because MSF usually come here once a week. They have a mobile work clinic. So sickness will not wait for seven days. So we need a permanent health center to be established here medicines and so forth. Those living in Louis, roughly 40 kilometers away on a bad road, are much luckier than Juana Tebriwa from Kotobi, who finds it difficult to access the better facilities there because it is too far and expensive to get there. Louis is a good hospital, which is treating cases from across the region. For these communities, they can only hope that the guns remain silent and that high-level peace talks succeed so that they can once again receive the medical care that they deserve.